Hi, I'm Peter Busch. I'm the chair of the Mobility Working Group. And on behalf of the Trusted IT Alliance, I welcome you here to our Stuttgart Hackathon here in beautiful Ludwigsburg. I'm very excited to host that hackathon here because I'm very keen to understand and to find out what cool solutions we're going to develop together with our partners here from the Trusted IT Alliance. Hello Maria, I'm very excited to have you from Fetch here together in our hackathon. What's your impression here? So it's, uh, it's great to be here. We're from Fetch AI. My name is Maria Minenerkoa and uh, we're really uh, excited to be here working on all these innovations. Uh, we're really looking forward to working with our partners with, from Streamer, from Share and Charge, from Bosch, from uh, Riddle and Code. Really good time. It's uh, very interesting to work with these innovations, uh, with the blockchain, with distributed ledger technologies, uh, with artificial intelligence, and put it all together to make really good innovations uh, that will be deployed on the electric vehicle. We have Jaguar Pace here, and so we're really excited to be here and be part of the team. Yeah, exactly. And I think we make a big step into the future of the uh, mobility scene here, because when we look at the e-mobility e future that we see, we're going to have a really, really interesting perspective using our distributed ledger technology use cases that we are doing prototyping now. And together with our sensor technology and with our car uh, vehicle technology and together with the agent technology and the other software, I think we're going to really make some very, very interesting progress here. What is also interesting is uh, how the, the collaborations work. So we have partners from the industry, from the corporate uh, world, we have uh, very interesting and exciting startups and it's really good to see the collaboration that will just inspire more innovative uh, projects. We have a use case on electric vehicle charging uh, and another second use case on machine witness. So um, these use cases basically use the data that is produced by the car and are able to get the data and um, with the use of blockchain technology then, then distribute it in the decentralized way. So very exciting future that we have in front of us. And I think besides the fun that we have driving that car, it, because it gets ex extremely new sensations in that car driving, and together in the future with the distributed ledger technology, I think we have a very interesting times before us. Yeah, I have to confirm, it's a very powerful car and Peter is a fantastic driver. He is really testing it to the maximum. So Thank you. yeah, it was really good to be here.